Hey, welcome to Tools Pack. So, uh, as you know, I bought that Snow Thrower 21 inch 40 volt brushless uh, Snow Thrower from Zurich Tool not too long ago. I can't wait to do a review for you guys. I used it twice, I didn't film those two times, and then I end up breaking it. <laughs> so, anyway, now it's in need of repair. Uh, anyway, the model number for this thing is the RY. 40862VNM. Uh, I'm gonna show you real quick what's happening with it. So this thing used to be very quiet, but now, so I got low speed here. I'll make you hear it at low speed. It vibrates like crazy. Yeah, it's a bit loud. And if you go on a high speed, it was it was like super quiet before. Look at this. Even my gas one is not that loud. Well, I'm, I'm exaggerating a little bit. It is loud, but you know, this is getting ridiculous. And the other thing too, it's I'm gonna break everything apart if I use it like that. So let's see here. I'll show you the shaft turning. I don't know if you can see it, but you can see the middle moving up and down like this. So the shaft here and the bending on me. So if you see my snow shovel video uh, not too long ago, I got the carport here and what's happening, it's when it snows a lot, all the snow falls on the side here and it packs down on the side. So I was trying to, I did the shovel the whole driveway, well not shovel, but I used the snow blower to do the whole driveway. And then I went beside the carport at the end and the snow was almost as tall as the light here and about half the snow thrower and uh, so I had to put less of pressure against the snow in order to be able to push it through this thing because it was like it was like not too wet but it was like packed and uh, you know you can make snowball very easy with it. it was sticky snow right and uh, yeah, so it put too much pressure against the shaft here and it bent it. So anyway, I got this uh, snow thrower at Direct Tool uh, warranty and exchange is just 30 days on this thing. Uh, so I cannot exchange it at Direct Tool. I need to, I had to contact Huawei and they're sending me at the repair place to get it fixed, which is about an hour and a half from my house. Uh, so I'm not too happy about that, but you know, that's the downside. If you know, you get better deal if you buy your stuff at Direct Tool, but compared to Home Depot, it's a pain in the butt for <laughs> warranty. <laughs> Home Depot will let you return stuff for like a year in there with uh, no question asked, right? So anyway, so I have to go get this thing fixed. I could so hopefully the repair shop can get this up and running in good time. So, cause we're supposed to have snow in the next week again. And uh, hopefully I can do better review video about this. Uh, yeah, hopefully after this incident, it works good. I guess it's a little learning curve there. Uh, my gas one is way heavier duty than this so i never have to worry about slamming against the snow or doing anything like that uh, this one is a little bit more fragile there it does a good job when it moves the snow away. are we going to move the snow all winter that's the question <laughs> anyway okay so i'll let uh, I'll, I'll give you updates on what's going on with this thing as i find out and uh, we'll see you in the next video